Pitch on the way. Popped up. Set it all. Under it. Makes the catch. Lion Nation heading to the NCAA Regionals. Hello there and welcome to this episode of Inside Southeastern Baseball with head coach Matt Reiser presented by your local Southern Quality Four Dealers, Champagne Beverage, and also Buddy's Bar and Grill as it is a postseason championship edition of our show. And I welcome in uh, the head baseball coach of the 2014 Southland Conference champions, the Southeastern Lions coach Matt Reiser. Coach, congratulations. It's been a heck of a week. We have a lot to show our viewers this week. But first of all, congratulations on winning the championship. Uh, thank you. I appreciate it, man. I'm just so proud of the kids. Uh, they did a fantastic job. I obviously, back in September, of buying into this, this concept that we talked about. Stay with the plan, stay the process, stay positive, and just compete. That's, that's it. Flat out, I told them all week. Compete from pitch one to last pitch and watch what happens. They did a fantastic job all week. We're going to take a look at all the highlights and also get you ready for this weekend's regional as the Lions will be on the road at Alex Knox Stadium to take on LSU in game one in the Baton Rouge regional. That's very exciting. The last couple of years, in the Southland Conference Tournament. Uh, you were an assistant coach. You got to the championship game this year as, your head coach, as the head coach. It just looked to me the guys weren't going to be denied this time as they went out there and dominated Central Arkansas to get this victory. Oh, the kids did a fantastic job of just showing up resilience. You know, obviously uh, from, from first game with Northwestern to Sam back to Northwestern, uh, those, were, those were three tough ball games. Right. I mean, just hard fought, even a championship game. But obviously they started feeling that momentum a little bit. We come out, we score six early. Uh, obviously Central Arkansas does a good job of coming back, put some pressure on us. But uh, like you said, the guys just weren't going to be denied. They had that resilience that, that this is ours and we're going to take it. We're going to walk you through and show you all the highlights from the bracket of the Southland Conference Tournament. And not trying to be biased, but our side of the bracket was very tough. Sam Houston State, Northwestern. Uh, Sam Houston State was also awarded an NCAA Regional today, so that just shows you how good of a baseball team that was. But let's start on Wednesday morning at 9 a.m. as the Lions took on the Demons of Northwestern State. Here's the highlights. Here we go early in the morning on Wednesday to start the tournament. Andrew Gonvon was big to start the tournament. Had a couple of big RBIs in this one and started out in the first inning. Yeah, you know, we uh, we did a good job of coming out swinging bat early and obviously had that freshman of the year on the mound for Northwestern and had beat us earlier in the year uh, you know, in game one of our series and uh, just did a fantastic job coming out to shoot. You know, it was 9 a.m. for us, but it was 9 a.m. for them as well and told them that's not a reason why we can't come out fired up and also you could see by our play uh, we, we, we did and you know again their guy did a fantastic job we had some opportunity to score some more runs uh, but their guy did a fantastic job eliminating some situations. This is the story of the game though Andre Tritoro was tremendous he's been tremendous all year long uh, probably got robbed uh, should have been the Southland Conference Pitcher of the Year uh, and he pitched like the Southland Conference Pitcher of the Year in this ball game. Oh he showed he is he's the best pitcher in the conference uh, by, by, by far you know also we held him out the last weekend to make sure he was healthy for the tournament and he comes out and gives everything he's got. Goes 120 pitches and absolutely just dominates uh, all game, really. You know, he did a good job of getting some ground balls. Also, he got the strikeouts. We had some nice defensive plays behind him, uh, but also did a fantastic job for us. There's a nice play defensively uh, by Northwestern State, throwing out Godwell deep in the hole. But this is probably the blow of the game here. Base is loaded. He bangs one off the wall here and allows you to stretch out your lead. Yeah, you know, we uh, had two outs, nobody on. We did a fantastic job of getting a little something going. Uh, had a walk, HPP, and another walk. There's some good at bats ahead of Andrew. And also, Andrew comes up there with a big two out knock to get his fourth RBI of the day. And uh, it shows you why he's, you know, the newcomer of the year. Uh, he's the newcomer of the year in the conference and uh, all conference outfielder. And obviously, did a fantastic job of driving some guys in. Nice play by your middle infield there. Kenny Menard, Jacob Williams turns the tough double play. Lions would add one here in the later innings uh, to, to go up to have a five run. Anytime you have a little more cushion it is good. It's a, got a double there by Sam Robertson. Yeah, you know, again, at the end of the day, it's never enough. I uh, obviously saw what we did Northwestern later in the, in the tournament, and, uh, we, you know, we get a right hop here that uh, bounces over the, the shortstop, but that's why you keep competing. That's why you keep playing. You keep playing hard because uh, you don't know. You don't know when the mistake's going to happen. You don't know when the ball's going to bounce your way, and a uh, fantastic job there of adding to the lead there for the ninth inning. Bring in Dylan Hills and he shuts the door uh, at the end as the Lions were winning game one of the tournament against Northwestern State. And you've been so lux uh, you've had such a luxury of guys at the back end of your bullpen with Dylan Hills and uh, Mason Klotz, and they were good this weekend. Yeah, veteran staff that does a good job of closing that ball game. It makes us confident every time we go out there to, to finish one off. Well, Coach, if you're going to win the tournament, you got to win game one. And Northwestern was a team you were very familiar with. You threw Andre Trattoria out there. He was well rested. 
and man, was he good in game one. Yeah, did a fantastic job. You know, obviously we knew the rematch was coming once we saw the seedings after the uh, last series there. And uh, yeah, it's tough. You know, you took a, uh, took two out of three from them at our place. We had a walk-off win uh, in game three against them. So we knew they were going to be a little fired up for that game one. And uh, But the good part about it was they hadn't seen Andre yet. And Andre did a fantastic job of going out there, sinking the baseball. Defense played really well behind him, and we scored enough runs to win a ball game. All right, let's take a break. We come back, we're going to show you the rest of the highlights from the tournament and get you ready for this week and as your Lions will be taking on LSU in the Baton Rouge Regional for a chance to move on and advance towards Omaha. All right, let's take a break right here on Inside Southeastern Baseball. Head coach Matt Reiser presented by your local Southern Quality Four Dealers, Champagne Beverage, and also Buddy's Bar and Grill. Stay with us.